Okay, guys, welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World the game where today, hopefully, fingers crossed. Yeah, that's right. I got the uh, Amargosaurus unlocked. Why, why, did I, why did I say that like I was American? I've got it unlocked. There we go. <laughs> so, uh, hopefully all of you guys managed to get this as well. I hope, hopefully as well, I'm putting up the day of. I'm recording this at precisely six minutes past six and it ended at six o'clock. So we're pretty bang on. So, um, yeah, let's see what we- Oh, look! 2,500 DNA! And we'll get into that, actually, in a minute. But first, let's collect all that, and unfortunately, we did get coin. And there it is, a Margosaurus. Now, ooh, even two- ooh, 2,600 VIP points. Oh, glorious. Beautiful. Um, also, um, yes, I wanted to say about the legendary packs. Um, if you remember, Legendary Packs had their, like, DNA nerfed again. Like, that was a big ruckus. Everyone was in uproar about it. Because there was no need to change the Legendary Packs. Because they didn't they didn't change any other pack. So why change the Legendary Pack? But they put up this status on Twitter. Um, and I think maybe there are other social medias as well. Saying that they have actually put the uh, DNA in the Legendary Packs back to normal. So that is... A, finally, a good step that they've done. They've decided, wait, no, we've done this. We shouldn't have just done that. We should have just changed it. So now legendary packs come with back to their 1,250 DNA as opposed to their 500. To be honest, they were originally 2,500, but you know, baby steps at a time. Oh, and a free 40. <laughs> I don't know, I like, only had like a little brief moment to do that um, the other day. So without further ado, Let's get an Amargosaurus. So, it is a tournament creature, which means that it is going to eat up all of my bucks. Oh, look at it! That looks great! Ooh, very, um, very textured. I do like it, though. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have anywhere to put it. <laughs> that tends to be the problem, James. All right, we're gonna switch in you, and we're gonna hatch it again, because after this failure, we just sort of shoved it back in its test tube. Or it's egg. I think they still- yeah, they still come from eggs. And there we go! <gasps> Look at it! Oh, that looks awesome! I kind of like the way it looks normally. So, we now have a drama queen back in here. Although I don't know if it's much of a drama queen as- as it is a spiky queen. Um, so, let's have a look at the uh, little fact we get. Claim reward, 5,400 food. <gasps> this herbivore can live up to 100 years if not eaten by a Tyrannosaurus first. Ooh. Wait, is that right? Did they live? I don't think Amargosaur and T-Rex lived in the same area. I, it's just a pun. I, uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> They're like, James, you have to overanalyze everything. Yes! Yes, I do, or else I get the YouTube comments after me. <laughs> so let's feed it to level 10. And level 10, 816 health and a universal logo for attack. Uh, if we just do that, 231 attack. So pretty darn good. Um... So, we need to get seven more now. How expensive are they? This is where... Oh. Wait, what? Like, I'm gonna have to... Okay, guys, a two seconds. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> yeah, I knew. I knew it. I knew they wouldn't do stuff like that. Uh, so, let's have a look. It is a herbivore. And f can we just say that it is one of the better herbivores? If we look at all this, none of them are really... I mean, Kentrosaur is pretty good. 718 uh, attack, which is actually very good. Yeah, a Marga costs 7,500. It is the most expensive. Oh no, it's the same as Segnosaurus. Oh, but I, I kind of want to keep the stats. I think I know its attack. I don't know its health. Because it was on the Facebook group. Somebody had uh, managed to get it and win it like how many times? I don't even know how people managed to do that. It's obviously hackers. So uh, let's see the level 24. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Looks like it's got a little bit of a suntan. Oh. That kind of reminds me of the Godzilla toys, um, like the 1998 Godzilla toy. I, I feel like there was one that had purple highlights. So here we go. So it has 1,399 health and 395 attack at level 20. Uh, meaning that it kills itself in three hits, so it's kind of balanced, but it does have good health and good attack, which is always important. Uh, so let's have a look at the reward. 45,000 food! Ooh! The Amargosaur ran at a speed up to 31 miles per hour, about as fast as a rhino. How big was it? It couldn't have been that big, right? If it ran as fast as 31 miles an hour. Oh, wow, that would be impressive. A sauropod. I always thought that sauropods had to have, like, one foot on the ground. 
at, at all times, so they couldn't really run. That either somebody is at fault. Somebody's wrong here. It, it could be me. I'm go, I'm going off freaking um. Uh, walking with dinosaurs fact here. <laughs> I think it's that one episode with the Allosaur where he goes da -da 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 -da, it attacks the herd. Um, and I'm pretty sure in there they say they ca they can't run very fast because they have to have one foot on the floor. See, this is this is just what it becomes at, at a time. I just I'm, I'm a bundle of facts that I don't know whether are facts or are outdated facts. Ooh, first time. Wow, we're getting a Margasaur. Not much of a drama queen, I've got to say. So let's get to level 30. Uh, ooh, seeing uh, not too much change. I'm expecting to see a big change at level 40, as it always is. And two, that's okay, I can deal with that. Is it gonna be more purple this time? Uh, it's maybe a little bit more brown. It's hue and saturation's been, it's saturation's been turned up a little bit. And it has a little bit of, like, color stroke on its, uh, side? Side things? Yeah, hard to tell. Okay, so let's level up to level 30, where it has 2,000 and... 2,132 health and 603? 603 attack, there we go. Beautiful, we'll get there eventually. Oh, yes, aren't you pretty? I can't wait to use you. So what's the uh, the third one? 210,000 food and was that 100 bucks? I think it was 100 bucks. Amargosaur has large spines on its back that can be used for defense or show. Is that right? Can it pick and choose, can it? Okay, so it's gonna cost a fair ton now to get level 40, really. To be honest, a level 40 Amargasaur, if you've got a level 30, you may as well. The only killer is that it is. It's not the DNA I'm fussed about, it's the books. You remember we were on like 30,000 books? Uh, yeah. Slowly going down. And the final one, once I've got this one, I don't need any more. <sighs> there we go. Awesome. Okay, so let's just level these guys up. And there is a cool event to uh, do, actually, where we can win a pack pretty easily. Um, I didn't do the pterosaur pack. I think it was, uh, I think it ended just before the tournament ended. And I didn't manage to get that because I did use all my dinosaurs. If you were curious how many cups I had, it was 2,500. Um, there seemed to be like big gaps. Like I would go through the tournament pretty, pretty easily. And then they would just be like, okay, there's a big plateau or a big steep drop up. No, plateau means it's flat lines, right? Yeah, no. <laughs> It was like a big gap. There was like 200 cubs gap. And it seemed to happen in the Dominator League. Um, after I, like, you know, after I had to wait for my dinosaurs to refresh, it would sort of appear. And I'm not too sure what that was exactly. Like whether that was just... Yeah, it, was just, it just like came out of nowhere because I didn't encounter that when I um, did that video the first time. So it seems like as time goes on, maybe that sort of happens? I don't, it doesn't matter. It's, anyway, the uh, tournament... Pretty, pretty good. Um, again, it's sort of like, look what you come up against. You could be against 40 commons. You could be against 40 legendaries. And maybe they'll keep it that way because it's, for me anyway, it's a lot easier like that. I do lose a few battles. Um, I don't have to use my best dinosaur. As long as I use one really good dinosaur, I can sort of fodder off my other two dinosaurs as meat shields. Um, to just take the hits and make them waste their goes. So here we go. Two level 30s and the level 40... Oh, that's the Amargasaur we know and love. The frill up the neck. Gorgeous. Or the back of the neck. There, it's up the neck means the throat, really. So, that has cost me... Ooh, God, I don't even want to know how many bucks it was. Ugh. I mean, it's not even over yet, either. How much? How many DNA? 90 DNA and 120 bucks. Oh, thank God. There we go. Well, it was probably about maybe 15,000 DNA it cost me. And there it is. Oh, my God, it's bioluminescent. <laughs> There's no shadow on it, no shading. That is interesting. Well, there it goes. <coughs> Nibbling its little side parasites. Whoa. Well then, somebody has no uh, shadows on you. Oh wow, I like the thick neck. It kind of looks like a dragon. With, yeah, it kind of reminds me of that, um, oh, what was that? With Sean Connery as the dragon, like Dragonheart or something like that. I, don't, I haven't seen that movie in ages, but I'm getting the vibe from the head shape. So we got some frills on the back there. Um, oh my god, this, this guy needs some Photoshop to make it look good, I tell you that. <laughs> well, let's level up to level 40. And there's 3,016 health with 853 attack, which makes it, I think, the best um, herbivore out there, I think. Even including, maybe not the legendary hybrids, but pretty much out of all the dinosaurs, 
uh, all the herbiv herbivorous dinosaurs. Anyway, what we're gonna get? 156 points, 100 bucks, and a lot of food. Like many herbiv herbivorous herbivorous dinosaurs, a Margasaur travels in herds for protection from predators. That's remember, all you have to do is outrun your friend, <laughs> and then he'll and you'll survive, and he'll end up as lunch. So that, and uh, let's have a look at the roster. So, I mean, oh, of course, it's not the best. It's not the best of all because we have Sagnasuchus and nothing can beat that thing. But, um, oh, it's not as good as Ankylodoc. Of course it's not. Oh, my God. Okay. How much DNA does Ankylodocus cost? Hold the phone. I just want to check that. Uh, Ankylodocus. How much? 10,920. So it's an extra, it's an extra 3,000 and odd. DNA times that by seven. Seven times three, 21,000 DNA ish. Put, say like, say like 22, 23,000 DNA. Um, yeah, I'd say Margasaur's worth it actually. Um, you save like 22,000 DNA and you're only losing out on 200 attack and how much health? Like, how much health does it have? Ooh, I buy that. How much health does uh, Angelodocus have? Where are you? You're around here. So, th there you are. Sorry. Three th so you're you're getting 200 extra health and 300 extra, sorry, 200 extra attack ooh, and 300 extra health. So for 22,000 DNA, I'd say Amargosaur is probably the best herbivore um, in terms of bargain. Because the next herbivore is, could be Stegoceratops, but I don't have that guy maxed. Again, something I need to do is get that to level 40, but even then, and I don't know about Urantius. I'm gonna say it's expensive. But anyway, let's defeat nine opponents with a Magasaur. Um, and you know, just for good me measure, let's put in Gorgasuch. Because, <laughs> oh, you have your shadow now. Oh, I see how it is. Okay, well, let's use it here. So hopefully you guys got this, because actually, when I saw it, um, it starts when it was kind of leaked in quotations. Somebody managed to get it. Um, it did look really good, um, and I was like, wow, this could be a really good herbivore that I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use all the time when it comes to events like this. Or, I mean, look at that, it can kill them, and the, yeah, I mean, probably even a level 20 legendary could kill in one hit. Uh, a little bit of worried about this thing, the little, little Dilophosaurus. Um... No, yeah, but we've got the health to tank this. Can we do it? So he had one. Oh, we can kill him in two. Hell yeah. Did he block? Yes, he did. Rubbish. So Suchotris, we don't have to worry about because he's only got 100 attack. Yeah, this is awesome. Okay, we let's not get too excited yet. James, we've still got a lot to go. So I'm going to go for four reserves here, hoping he blocks for some. He did. Uh, was he on three? <coughs> oh, God, I've got a frog in my throat. So, oh, he goes for four. He's got one block. Oh, taking the hits, taking the hits. So, I'm going to go for two, two, and then four reserve. There we go. And he did go for the block. Awesome. Not having to switch out yet. To be honest, these dinosaurs are not on par with me. Uh, the hundred level 120 Giganotosaurus might be, though. Not going to lie. Uh, okay. Um, now, I would take Gig Giganotosaurus on, however... Um, I mean, this Labyrinthosaurus on, but then Giganotosaurus is coming in. And I'm a bit worried about that thing. So, I'm gonna go for that. Damn it! Oh! Okay. Okay. We can't take a single hit. Or a single death, sorry. So, he had like eight, did he? I think he had eight. So, I'm not worried about taking hits. Gorgasu just has life for days. So, I'm gonna go for four reserves, one block, and there it is! There's the ticket. We need to win with a Margasol. That's what we need to do. Okay, three out of four. Wow, okay. So he, we can kill him in two. Even then. And you know what? I'm really not worried about uh, Giganotosaurus. But just in case he didn't block, I'll go for two. Uh, let's see how much attack it had. Only 147. Okay, yeah. We didn't have to be worried about him at all, did I? Wow, these are pretty easy. Just that level 120 sort of got me a bit spooked. So one, factor in two, and then there you go. And did he go for two? He did! Whoppa! It might get hard with the last two, though. Oh, level 300, but that's a common. James, come on, that's a common, though. So, ooh, wow, he's got a lot of attack if he goes for it. Ooh, ooh. 
Could have done a lot if you'd went for six. So, one, two. I'm going to go for that. Three block, four reserves. And there it is. Yeah, this is risky, actually. But we're going to do it. We're going to get that super rare pack. And there we go. And hopefully, they haven't changed the prize in the super rare pack. We just need to double check that. So, one, two. And then that. Oh, that was lucky. I didn't even... I didn't even remember what he went for. I was like, yeah, yeah, go for two extra just in case. And even then, yeah, that was lucky. Okay. Oh, the final two of flyers. Yes. So that 894 attack gets turned into less than 300. Okay, one, two, three. <laughs> just in case. Oh, wait. My shadows have gone now. Okay, that's interesting. Wow. Right. Uh, Ghost of Six. That's good. Kind of. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Two kills him. Factor in four, because we I don't think... We could probably take one hit, but I'm not risking it. Yeah, we definitely could take one hit. I could have went for uh, one reserve, three block. Yeah, oh, wow. I could have went for loads, actually. Okay. But we kill him in one hit still. And that is it. Oh, so we only need a Gorgasu just from like two dinosaurs. But apart from that, a Margasaur. There you go. Bas we'll just say Beaver basically did it by himself. There it is. The unshadowed version, which is really weird looking. <laughs> but it can, it's like a dragon Sauropod. Okay, so the prize is... Oh, we didn't get to see the DNA. But I'm imagining it's still 500. Quetzalcoatlus, which is still a pretty good dinosaur to sell because... Um, I'm going to have gonna have loads of those anyway. Um, and let's just have a check. Legendary pack. DNA. Yeah, back to 1,250. Um, books is, I think, was always 500, I think. And the food. Yeah, the food is. Yeah, everything, actually. Because the food was like 50,000, I think. And now it's 130,000. And coin is like quarter of a million. And it used to be like 50,000 as well. So that's really good to see. So there you are, guys. Um, what's in here, actually? Ooh, a Margasol wouldn't stand a chance. <laughs> Maybe against a Pterodactylus. You know what? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. I'll buy it back once and we'll do this fight. Uh, where are you? <gasps> Ooh, Ankylodocus is free. You cost 186. Uh, what was it? Yeah, it must be 186. So I'm going to go... Oh, no, I just... Oh, God, no. Um, you know what? We'll start with Udon, which is basically the same as the uh, Pterodactylus. I'm uh, sorry, the Allosaurus. Um... Oh my god, uh... Ooh. This is gonna be a tough one, guys. Um, and then... Elophosaurus? Yeah, let's go! Let's go! This is gonna be tough, though! Newdon, with its amazing power and health, is, uh... is stumped by a level 1,438 Allosaurus. To be expected, that is a pretty high level. Uh... Ooh. <laughs> no, you're not killing me! One, two... Doesn't even kill him. Oh my god. Oh, this is gonna be really tough. It's gonna be like kill, 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 kill. Even though, saying that, a Margasaur only has like 1,200 attack. So even then. Yeah, he's gonna go for one. Um, Right, okay. I think. Oh man, this is. Oh, oh, look at it. <laughs> look at it. It's gloriousness. I don't think we've done this one. We really needed a Gorgasuchus or something. It's a tough team to face up against. Um, so he's definitely got one block. We cannot kill him no matter what. So I'm going to block for two and reserve for one. Luckily, he's... Oh, God. Oh, God, he could kill me. Oh, but he switches out. Okay, that's good. That's good. It might be up to Erlophosaurus to win this. Ooh! <laughs> All right, then. Four reserve. I mean, yes. Four reserve one block. Please, go. It doesn't matter. Erlophosaurus needs to kill. Oh, still 14,000 health, though. Oh, he's got one block. That's going to make all the difference. And, <laughs> and down goes Colorful. All right, okay. All right, so one, two, three. Oh, no. I don't think we can do this, guys. Honestly. Um, I don't think so, because... Uh, that Pterodactylus, man. Oh, God. Uh... It depends what he's got. It really does. You know what? I'm going to block for six. I'm going to block for six because we can't take two hits. Uh, yep, there it is. Okay. 
Now, we could win this by cheating. Oh, there it is. Okay, that's good. That's good. Um, what do we do? What do we... I, yeah, we can't win this. He kills me in a couple of hits. One, two... Let's, let's, let's try to be sneaky here. Let's try to get this up. I mean, I could do that anyway. Um, oh, no. Well, there goes, there goes that one advantage I had. I died one hit now. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's let's try to be sneaky one more time. I think he's just going to go for four again, though. Oh, oh, and there it is. The low battery sign. Beautiful. Uh, you know what? We may as well kill Roger Staker. We're not winning this. And even then, in oh, God, did I kill him? No, I didn't even kill him. Why did I go for one reserve? I could have killed him. 95. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not... Oh, you know what? Yeah, go on, fine. We'll watch him die. No! Got a puke a rainbow. Beautiful. Yep. Yep. And that was all because I put in a Margosaurus <laughs> instead of something good. So, guys, if you enjoyed the video, uh, well, there is a Margosaurus for you. Hopefully... I've um, showcased a little bit for you. It's a, it's definitely a good herbivore. Not the best, but as far as DNA goes, it is top two, maybe even top three. Depends where Ankylodocus fits in and the other, uh, the other herbivores that I don't have, like Urantius and um, Ankylodocus. But I'd say it's definitely one of the better ones. Um, just want to quickly check anything in here. Ooh, I'll take that one. And, any, and what about this? Uh, oh, yeah, you never, you get, it's rare, but you may get one like that. And if you do, ooh, snap it up. And you know what? I'm going to trade. I'm going to trade that because there's no way really to earn, um, I'm definitely not doing that one, earn VIP points without actually opening packs. So let's get even more VIP points, yes, and some 10 bucks. So if you enjoyed this video, guys, like I said before, leave a like until next time. I'll see you later. Oh, bye bye